is up guys here to play some money ball pool today and i know you guys are probably thinking what it hasn't been a week and he's already posting shit it, it it's improving guys we're gonna we're gonna I, I like i said slowly we're gonna start trying to get to the daily uploads i don't know why it's so hard for me to just upload a video every single day but i don't know it's a struggle sometimes but i did end up home alone with my little sister so uh i was able to have her shut up so that I could record a video which is obviously a good thing so yeah if we win this match we'll have 500 million coins we had 500 million coins in my last video and why am I not getting matched up come on there we go all right we're going up against Hassam and uh boy, the dad looks like a priest all right hopefully uh no we don't have break I wanted the break um I actually haven't even played like all day so it would have been pretty nice to have the the break so yeah um how's everybody's day been going so far drop a comment let me know if it's been good or bad and um i just got like a quick topic to topic to talk about and that's revolving <clears throat> my god my voice is like destroyed right now that's revolving around the whole like everybody asking for coins um i used to give out free coins i used to do giveaways i used to like uh give out like 50 million coins like every other two weeks and yeah it was pretty great and then after a while uh i came in contact with mini clip and yeah um i i my account like they they told they told me that i was breaking the their terms of service so that i could possibly get banned for that so yeah don't really want to do that and um also it wouldn't be fair to give coins to one person when I haven't given coins to anybody else, so yeah, it wouldn't be fair if one person were to just get like I start giving them coins when I haven't given coins to anyone else that I that has asked. Also, people come uh, often ask me if I could play on their account. That's also against Mini Clips Terms of Service. It's it's account sharing according to them. Only you can play on your account. So yeah, that's also a big no. I can't do that. And why is he shooting this? I mean, I get you're worried that you're not going to have position on it later. But I'm pretty sure you could slip it by my green. Like, this is going to... Oh, God. This this is not going to end well for him. There's, like, no way he's going to be able to keep control of where the key wall ends up. I mean... No, no scratch. It didn't go in, though. So, that's a good thing. So... Yeah, um, we've been using the Galaxy Cube quite a bit lately, and, uh, it's, it's been pretty great. Needless to say, the Galaxy Q is one of my favorite cues. I'm so glad I have this thing right now. So, I did that shot so that I could try to get position to break out my yellow ball that's right there. So, if we could do that right now, that'd be pretty great. So, let's add some top spin, and did I break it out? Okay, so I decently broke it out. Um, all I need to do now is a combo shot. And it shouldn't be too hard of a shot. So hopefully we can get this. Also, oh my god, I did not hit that hard enough. Not at all. But did he get stuck? Did I end up? I think I left him stuck. Because the eight ball is like blocking off his yellow and his green. I'm not too sure if he's completely stuck. He may have, He may have a shot to make somewhere around there, but... As far as it looks, he does look stuck. Yeah, he hasn't called a pocket because he's, he's obviously thinking about what he's got to do here. So, yeah, that ended up going a lot better than... Ex Ooh. No, never mind. All right, so, yeah, this went out pretty damn well. Luckily, the cue ball ended up, like, all the way down, which is obviously a good thing. So, yeah, I think he's trying to get his balls stuck with mine. And why did I call that? Because he actually did do it. Alright then. I did. I thought that the purple had enough to go in by itself, but apparently not. So we're just going to tap it, and hopefully his yellow won't go in anymore. That's what I was going for. I was hoping that the purple ball would end up higher, but actually I think that's good enough. I don't think that uh, he can... Can he shoot that though? No, he can't. All right. All right. But now he did it even better. Now I can't do shit. Uh, this is a 
bad safety battle for me. He's he's doing the safeties pretty well. So we're just gonna whack this and hope for the best, cause that's that's the that's the only skill I obtain in my little brain. So uh, no. All right. Well, now that we're right here, I think we could play a safety. So hopefully my purple will end up close and never mind. I needed to hit that a bit harder and add a little top spin. So I think we are gonna lose this match. Unfortunately, this dude totally. I don't know. That was a pretty decent safety battle. He did. He did win it though. He did win the safety battle. Unfortunately, so I doubt anything else is really gonna happen throughout the rest of this match. So I think I might just cut it here. And go to my next match. I'm not sure if that's something I should do in my videos. Like, do, yo, do you guys want me to do that? Like, if I already know I'm going to lose the match. Because, like, I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to lose this match. There's no way he's going to mess up in any way, shape, or form. But, I mean, if you guys want me to just stick through the rest of matches, let me know. Like, should I leave matches early? Not, like, leave, but, like, just cut the video. And then if something something does happen, I could just start the video again. Like if he scratches or something, like should I do that, guys? That's been something I've been wondering about. Like, would that make my videos better, or would it be the same thing? You're still watching eight ball pool gameplay. It's just not me playing. It's m my opponent playing. So yeah, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. So yeah, it's pretty obvious that we lost this match, unfortunately. Um, yeah, he could have possibly scratched there, but he didn't. And I'm going to start using another Q now because, uh, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm taking a big toll to my coins, not, not using, uh, uh, what's it called? A legendary Q because when I don't get my coins back, it's not good. So let's do the Inferno Q because this Q, it's, it's one of the most underrated. It's not too underrated, but it's a, actually a pretty good, uh, a pretty good legendary Q. So now that we are using a legendary Q, uh, we could uh, we could go into Berlin. So I won't have to worry about losing too much coins in one go. So yeah, hopefully we can win this match. We did lose the last match, but okay. So we scratched the eight on break, and now when you're playing a normal game, all you really have to think about is like how you're gonna pot every single ball but in berlin it's more it's like a lot trickier because you have to also think about like what good position can i leave myself to bank shot the eight ball like super easy like you don't want to have to go for a really hard bank shot i mean at least i don't want to i mean i guess other people can like you know for the thumbnail shot and shit but me myself i don't want to go like i just want to win the game like honestly like i just want my 25 million coins and i want to just go but I think I still got my orange here. So, yeah. That's that's pretty good. That is pretty good. So, now that finals are almost about to be over. They're over next week. And hopefully I can start doing more uploads. And I want to start doing face cam videos. If you guys want to see face cam videos, let me know. Like, let me know everything, guys. I just I just need more, more comments on this video, all right? Alright, so we're going to play safety. We lost our last safety battle. We won't lose this one, though. Because only we get to shoot. So, yeah. It's a good safety. Are you? Don't tell me he's going to be able to shoot that. Oh, that's a load of crap. Now, nobody in real life would be able to shoot that. Like, ever. I don't think there's anybody that is good enough to shoot. Like that good i don't know that's just such a cut shot like i don't think that's physically possible in real life so i don't yeah so i thought he was gonna go for it but he didn't so we want to separate these two balls right here and all right sweet we got a double pot now we gotta keep in mind the position for the eight ball so we're gonna add a little top spin and hopefully we can move on like forward in the table Oh, uh, God. I was thinking about staying a bit lower. But I think I think this is possible. It's obviously possible. I think any shot is possible. Unless it's, like, blocked off by something. Like the eight balls in the, in the way of the cushion. 
but now let's see if we can aim this right uh, let's add a little top spin we usually add a back spin but you know we always scratch when we do that so let's see if this will go in there we go all right sweet that was not too bad of a bank shot and yeah the video is coming up on 10 minutes so i'm thinking uh, no I've, I've done quick fire last two videos i do want to start doing a lot more quick fire though guys like if you do you guys enjoy quick fire like i know i've been asking you guys so many questions but like i don't care if you didn't answer the rest but do answer this one do you guys like quick fire is like quick fire is something i should be playing more often like do you guys enjoy it or should like i mean I don't want to just upload every single quick fire like I'll match I play. I, I like want to get a good score like above 15k, above 20k and like upload that instead of just uploading my mediocre 5k, 6k's that I've been getting like well that I got in my last two videos because I'm absolute trash. But obviously with time you get better. Like it how when people ask me, "How do you get so good at the game?" Guys, just practice. I I don't don't think that I just got on this game and then the next day I was just had a million coins and then the next day after that I had 10 million and then it just kept multiplying. No, guys, it took forever to get to the point where I was at. I used to play 8-ball pool when Qs didn't even have powers. Like, they didn't have powers and they would, uh, they, they, they were just for the style and they had, like, power-ups. Like, if you go, if you go try to find an old video, you'll see, you guys will see. Um, but yeah, I've been playing 8-Ball Pool for a long, 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 long time. It took an, an outrageous amount of time to get where I am right now. And I'm pretty sure I would be a lot better if my old account had it gone banned. I think I pretty much got banned for giving coins out and stuff like that. But yeah, if, a lot of people also always ask me if they can add, add me is right there. Also, for my next video, I want to I wanna do, like, an announcement of, like, playing with fans for an hour. And then after the next, I want to, like, I, I'm going to record every single game that I play. And I'm going to, like, upload highlights of that. So, ho hopefully that'll be cool. Hopefully I could record that video tomorrow. And, yeah, I know I just rambled on for, like, two minutes and a half. And you're probably thinking, oh, my God, I'm going to click off this video right now. If this dude don't shut up. Okay, I'll shut up for you guys. But if you guys did enjoy the video... Make sure to drop a like and I'll see you guys in the next one.